Hi, my name is Jasper and today I'd like to show you one of the best exercises you can do for a herniated disc. Before we continue with this exercise, uh, you need to realise that you don't want to do these exercises first thing in the morning. You want to get some movement in your spine first before you do it. So say you're getting up at 7 o'clock, make sure you walk about for an hour and a half, two hours till 9 and then start doing this. If you do this too early, it might be a bit too painful. So the exercise I'm going to show you is called the prone prop. It's an easy exercise. All you need to do is prop yourself up on your elbows. If you can have them. Yeah. So we're arching your back here. And this helps actually to push the disc a bit more forward. You hold this position for about 30 seconds to a minute. Uh, and after that, you just come down. Well, now, it's perfectly normal to feel a bit of discomfort in your lower back. Don't worry about that. But as soon as you're getting a shooting pain down your leg, or you get like a sharp pain in your back, you need to stop. You need to come down a tiny bit. Yeah. So what you can do then is you can put your fists underneath your chin and just do this exercise here. Now, we're using a bench here to do the exercise, but there's no excuse. You can do this at home, on the floor, on the bed. You can do it any way you like. So the next exercise I'm going to show you is a continuation of the first exercise. And this is called the prone press-up. Um, what we do for this one is I want you to place your hands underneath your shoulder for me. And you need to push yourself up, keeping the pelvis on the bench. But this is more like a dynamic exercise, so you need to go up and down. So I want you to come down and count to two when you come up. One, two, and then down. One, two, brilliant. We have about 15 repetitions of this and then um, take a 30 second break. Now, what I want to show you is uh, there's one mistake we often see with our patients in our clinic, and that is they do this exercise, but instead of keeping the pelvis on the floor, they actually keep the knees on the, on the floor. So if you can show me how you do that. See, and then we're not having enough arch in the lower back. So you really want to keep this pelvis all the way down there, and that's how you do the exercise. The last and final exercise I'd like to show you is called the standing back bend. And what it is, it's, it's a variation of the other two exercises I've given you, and you can use this one at work, obviously at work you can't lay down on, on the floor or you might not have even a table or nothing. So this is something you can do at work. Simple exercise. What you need to do is place your hands in the small of your back yeah, and just push forward. And it's the same thing as the other exercise we did. It's a dynamic exercise. So you push forward, you hold it and you come back again. And you push forward and you hold it and you come back again. Again, you do about 15 repetitions and then take about the 30 second break. Or you can do this whilst you're walking towards a coffee machine or to water machine or whatever you do, it's good to get some mobility in your lower back. Now, I was going to show you a variant of this, uh, which is actually even a bit better. If you wouldn't mind just walking out the scene. And you can do this also on a desk or a chair. Make sure it's stable. And what you do is you turn your hands away from you, the hand palms away from you, lean on a desk, and same thing, you arch your back. So you come forwards, you hold this, and come back again. Same thing here. So push forward, hold it for a few seconds, come back again. Remember, it's a dynamic exercise, so I want you to do about 15 repetitions. And same as what we did before, if you have a pain in your, in your leg, it should come up towards your lower back again. If it's too painful, just reduce your amplitude. Come back a bit, and come forward again. Well, now all the exercises we've just discussed, um, a good frequency to do them would be about five, six times a day throughout the day. Good luck with them.